See how people don't even realize, man. That even if we make make changes, the triple triple Come yourself. 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 Come Isaiah chapter 10 verse 1. Give me the book of Micah chapter 2 verse 10, man. And we are here to weak rebuke this wicked ass holiday. How you doing, King? How you doing, brother? Brother, what's your nationality? See that? See, the Seahawks losing, man, man. Their spirit is down, man. Right? You see that? And they don't even realize that World War III is on the rise, man. Right? And Roman Field, man, is going to end up being destroyed, man. Let's take the Lord with nuclear destruction. Bring this out, King. This is the book of Isaiah 10, verse 1. Bring it up. Woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees. Right. Woe unto right. you wicked nations that decree unrighteous decrees, man. The so-called white man said a decree to say that we should celebrate. We don't even need the mic. That's cool. Right? We don't need it. Right? Read that one more time, King. Okay? Read it one more time. Woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees. The Lord said, woe unto those wicked nations who decree unrighteous decrees. An unrighteous decree is a so-called white man saying that we should celebrate Thanksgiving, man. Right. right? Celebrate the slaughter and death and destruction of our 77 million Native Americans who are Israelites from the tribe of Gad, man. Right. 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 the Lord, man. These are things we got to realize, man. And us as men of the Lord, we're not declaring that, man. Right. We're not keeping that, man. Right? Keep reading. And that right grievous this which they have prescribed. Read to turn aside the needy. Hey, y'all about to go celebrate Thanksgiving? Hey, hey sir. Y'all about to go celebrate? You mad because y'all team lost? Huh? Ruins your turkey? See that? Right? Hey, y'all about to go celebrate Thanksgiving? Who's about to celebrate Thanksgiving? Raise their hand. I got it. Don't even worry about it. Who's about to celebrate Thanksgiving? Raise their hand. Right. And you're celebrating the death of 77 million Native Americans, man. Oh, right. 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 You see that? You see that? And that's why the so called white man got to be destroyed, man. Thus said the Lord, man. Hey, brother. Brother, what's your nationality? Brother, what's your nationality? Brother, don't let the white man pull you away. Don't learn who you are, man. Right? Continue reading. Turn aside the needy from judgment. To and turn what? To turn what? To turn aside the needy from judgment. Right, they want to. We're needy out here, man. It's so-called black, Hispanic, Native Americans. That's right. right. And the so-called white man, right, wants to lead us to judgment, man, of our people. Right. Being destroyed. Right. By having us sit there and make laws and decrees, man, right, to celebrate Thanksgiving, man, right, Christmas, man, all these wicked-ass holidays, man, right. right? Drop that, man. Bring this out. This is the book of Micah, chapter 2, verse 10. Yeah. 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 Arise ye and depart from this is not your rest. Because it is polluted. Because it is what? Because it, it is, is polluted. polluted. It's time for the blacks. What's your question, man? What's your question? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Wait. Come pick this Here. up, man. Get this shit. Do it. Man, do it. You know how we feel about this? That's how we feel about this. That's right. You said you do it. Let's deal with it, man. Right? Let's deal with it. You're dead, see that? The damn wicked devil, man, that the Bible speaks of, man. Right. Most of them not dealing with all that. That's, that's right. right. That's right. Yeah, that's right. You got the Spanish? Yeah. Hey, I'm talking to you. Come on, let me, man. Right? We all your foreign people, man. That's right. Right? We're not out here to celebrate the damn game, man. We're not out here, man, right, but they're football friends and family, man. Right. Most of not dealing with that, man. That's right, right. That's the Lord, man. Read that one more time, King Micah 2 and 10. This is the book of Micah chapter 2, verse 10. Bring it out. Arise ye and depart from this, 
is not your rest. Right, we gotta arise and depart out of the ways of Babylon the Great. You got a question? Got a question? <laughs> really? What's your name? I don't want man. Uh, How do you feel about slavery, man? Check this out. I don't like slavery. Right? Has anything happened to the nation of people who have enslaved the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans while people celebrate Thanksgiving, right, which is the death and destruction of over 77 million Native Americans? Has right. anything happened? I'm asking you. Don't touch me. Yeah, I'm asking you. Slow down a little bit. If I'm you asking want an honest you. answer, you got to talk Well, talk to me. Slower. Be a man and talk to me. I, I called you a fucking man. man. I'm the teacher, so talk to me. Well, I don't know what you're talking. I probably want to agree with what you're talking, but I I, I okay, believe, we, I believe drinking, we're all man. human beings living okay. together, and I love everybody. Give me second edges, man. Let's find out. He said he believes that we're all human beings. Give me are second not, edges. Chapter 6. I'm going to answer that in the Bible, okay? Give me see what God has to say I, about that. You know Give what? me second edges, chapter 6, Sunday, verse 54, man. I, I, I have hardship over that because uh -huh. I think if God was taking care of us, we wouldn't be in the fucking shithole that we're living. Wait, is God taking care of your nation of people? Aren't you guys benefiting off uh, off slavery by walking on stolen ground? Don't you have so-called white Palestinians striving? Are the Israelis striving after they got assassinated? Are those God's people, though? Does God have a chosen people? That's what God it comes down to. God, God should love everybody equal. I don't, well, I don't, God I don't, doesn't love everybody. That's right. He's God loves God people. God your nation of people. God, God should love your everybody. nation of people have taught God's chosen people that He loves everybody. Right. And that's a lie. And right. that's the biggest downfall and destruction of our people. That's which right. Is why we slavery because we have not listened to the laws of God that were only given to us. Right. 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 Second Edges chapter six verse fifty four. This is the book. A second Edges chapter six verse fifty four. Bring it out. And after these. Thou hast made us Adam, whom has has set as Lord over all that thou has made. Who right. Wrote, Hold on. Wrote, listen. The Bible's who wrote, who wrote who wrote that? Show? Blacks, Hispanics, right. and Native God, Americans. That's right. Men, who are called gods according to the Bible? Right. Read. God, Get God. that nasty finger away from the Word of God, right, man. Right, right, Read right. that again. Right. And it says, right. and after this, yeah, we are done with you, and you're going into slavery. That's right. right. Hispanics and Native Americans, man. That's right. right. The white man and the white woman and the white child is a goddamn devil the Bible speaks of. That's right. That's why the most I'm not dealing with them, man. Bring us out Exodus 21 and 16, man. Right? Bring it out. I'm sorry, I cannot walk away from that, but I just think we should all love everybody regardless of who they are. You are so loved by listening to the word and not interrupting the word when it comes out. If you love God, then listen to the word, man. So you're going to talk at me and I don't No, the Bible's going to speak and I'll let you speak. Yes, after the Bible comes out. Bring this out, second edges. That's a deep fucking book. I don't have that much time. So listen, we ain't got that much time either. Listen. And after these thou madest Adam, who has set as Lord over all that thou hast made, and him come we all, right. and the people also who thou hast chosen. So not only do all the nations that God created come from Adam, but also the people who God has chosen. So yeah. the Most High God has a chosen people. Do you so, know who they are? Because I don't, I don't buy into that? Does that mean my, my, my Okay, keep reading. Wrong? No, keep reading. See if you buy All it. these I have spoken before I've thee, been so long because thou hast sake. made the world for our sake. He made the world for what? For, for our, our sake. sake. For the sake of the so-called white men. For, for our, our sake. sake. As the other people. As the other people, man. Which right? also come from Adam. Right? The Santa Claus comes from Adam. Go ahead. That has said they are nothing. What did the Lord God say about these white men? They, they are, are nothing. nothing. That you are nothing, man, because you benefiting off damn slavery, man, by walking on stolen ground, man. Yeah. That's right. right. Man, trying to act like that, so we're all the same. I'm Most trying, to, I'm trying to get man. my That's opinion. Right. Really, for the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. That man. is right. How do you feel about that? You see that? Hey, your time is up. Stop touching the Bible, man. Back up, man. Back up. Probably been digging your nose in the game, man. Right? You see that? Digging in your ass. You know crack, what your man. fucking Back problem up, man. is? You know, you know what my fucking problem is? Is you walking on stolen ground. That's right! You know what my problem is, man? 
is that I can't wait for the Most High to come and destroy you, man. Thank Just you. Lord, man. For what you've done to our people, man. Really? Keep it up the block, man. We done talking, man. You Keep it up the block. We done talking, man. The Most High God's for blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. And that's it, man. And that's it. And that's my people, man. Right? And you're not my people. I'm trying you can't to love me, man. I am trying to find compromise so we can all live together. All right, let's Easy find out. Our world's all fucked up. Okay, so I, let's say but if I believe. Book, baby, Hold on. That might be the, that let's, might be the answer. Let's say, okay. Yeah. You just said something. Hold on. You I just, think everybody's created equal. Everybody should be loved. Hold on. You I just think said, our world's all fucked hold on. up right well, now. Well, God didn't say that we was equal. God said that the other nations are like spit. That's right. I think, God said, right. Matter. I think yeah. God said, I'm really into the Bible of Jesus Christ. And I'm not a religious man, but all men are created equal. Our the nation. Bible is not just the Bible of Jesus Christ. It was also written by prophets of the Lord, That's who right. were blacks, Hispanics, and Native American men. Right. Why? The so, Bible is why? a book for why? the Israelites why and the Israelites only. So, why do we have why do we have that so much hatred? Why? I'm an old white Give me man. Romans 9 and 13, bro. Give me Romans 9 and 13. Hey, I need everybody to listen to this verse. He just asked, why do we have so much hatred? Right, let's oh, find out if God actually hates in the Bible. Do you, hey, sure hey you, do there. you want to know if God hates He's or so, does God love everybody? Sorry, Romans I, 9 and 13. I right? love this mission, Romans but you, you got to listen to the others. You have to listen to the other side for the answers to make us heal. As it is what? We need to heal. Listen to this. As it is what? It is uh -huh. We need to heal us. Jacob, the Israelites, has he loved, but huh? But Esau. Who's the white man? But Esau. Who's the so-called white man? But Esau. How about what? Have I hated? The Lord hates all Caucasian races, That's man. right! If y'all got a goddamn problem with that, man, we don't give a damn, man. That's right! right? We live it in the last days, and America's on its way to being destroyed, man. Why y'all want to celebrate these wicked-ass holidays, man? Uh, Exodus 21 and 16, man. This is Exodus 21, verse 16. Bring it out. Give me Proverbs and verse 4. He that verse still the man. But he that what? And he that still the man. What is Thanksgiving about? And he, he that, that still the man. man. Yeah. And do what? And sell it, sell it How you doing, brother? Hey, hey, King. What's the nationality, bro? Why are you only out here for our people, man? Right? Hey, hey brother, with the CIA hat on. Hey, what's your nationality, bro? We out here for you. Hey, we the Israelites, the Bible speaks of, man. Right, we gotta repent and keep God's commandments and separate from these wicked devils, man. That's right. Right? That's right. Read that from the top again. And he that stole the man. The so-called white man stole the man, man. Stole the Native Americans, man. While everybody wants to celebrate wicked Thanksgiving. How you doing, sister? See, all people don't love us, man. All people don't know how to love their own people, right? Because they brainwashed by the wicked so-called white man. How do you guys feel about slavery? How do y'all feel about slavery? It's bad. Has something happened to the people who have enslaved the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans? What's happened? They don't want to deal with it. And he that what? And he, he that steal the man, man. Huh? and sell it to him. And do what? And, and sell, sell it to him. And they sold the Native Americans, man. Right? They stole a man, right? Came to this land, right? Where our people was already dwelling at, man. Right? Great, robbed, and pillaged and murdered them, man. Right, and then sold them. The same way he sold the southern kingdom, man. Right, go ahead. Or if he be found in his hand. And we're still found in the hand of the so-called white man. Just look at your dollar bill, man. Right? Look around you, man. We are still found in the hand of the so-called white man. Right? How you doing, King? Hey, brother, look. Hey, real quick, two seconds. Hey, brother, look. I want to show you what the guy calls you. What the most high guy calls you. Brother running, man. Right. Brother's running, man. Right? You see that? How you doing, family? Hey, brother, you see us over the side right here, man? Real, real quick. Two seconds. All right, blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans are God's chosen people, bro. We got to repent and keep the commandments, all right? Right? We're still found in the hands of the so-called white man. Go ahead. Or if he be found in his hand, uh -huh. he shall surely be put to death. What's going to happen to the white race? He shall surely be put to death. The Lord said that because you guys are benefiting off slavery by walking on stolen ground that belongs to the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, that all you other nations will be put to death. That's man. right. That's said the Lord, man. And there's nothing you can do about it, man. Right? Bring this out, King. Proverbs 24, man. Sorry, verse 1. Read all the way to 2, man. Give me the book of Proverbs chapter 3, the verse 31. A Proverbs chapter 24 from the top. Bring it out. Be not thou envious against Tell. evil men. So the Lord said that we're not going to be envious the of Lord. these wicked white devils, man. Hey, brother, with the 49er jersey on and Christmas hat on. 
See that? See that? That's madness, man. Right. right? Hey, hey, you see yourself on the sign right here? What's your nationality, man? Hawaiian. Hawaiian on your father's yeah. side? Yep. On your father's side? Okay, this is not for you. Oh. Right, it's not for you, but do you believe in God? Oh, yeah. You believe in God? Yes. The God of the Bible? God of the Bible, yeah. See that? See that? See that? He's about to get his judgment, man. Right? You see that? Well, make sure you're... God, all praise on my side, man. Right, hey, how does anybody feel about slavery? How do you feel about slavery, bro? See that? He don't want to deal with it, man. Right? They love it, man. Right. You see that? Hey! They love seeing so-called black people getting shot down in the streets by police officers, man. Right, right. They love seeing so-called black, Hispanic, and Native Americans celebrating Hallow Halloween, Thanksgiving, man. Right. right, Christmas, man. Right. right. Are you Hispanic? Are you Hispanic? Are you Hispanic? Are you Hispanic? I'm Native American. Hey, look, look, check this out. You believe in God? That's no, a beautiful no. thing. Believe the Creator. Right. You believe in the Creator, right? Yeah. You believe there's one Creator. What if I was to tell you that the one Creator who created everything has a chosen people, and salvation is only for those chosen people? Would you believe it if I brought it out the Bible, just one scripture? I don't read the Bible. I don't believe the Bible. You don't read the Bible? The you know why? Up. Hold on. Hold on, sister. You know why? I, I, hold on. I used, to, I used to think the same thing until I stopped listening to my oppressors teach me our heritage. Right? right? The Bible talks about this land being taken from you guys. It was prophesied that it was going to happen, that it was going to be taken from you guys from the so-called white man. Just one verse to show you, the, to prove what I just said. Give me the book of Jesus. Give me the book of Deuteronomy. Hold on. You gotta be quick on that sword. Right, we got a lot of they already left. It's all good. Right? See that? There's a bunch of wickedness going on here, man. Right? Proverbs chapter 24, man. Start at verse 1. This is the book of Proverbs chapter 24. From the top. Bring it out. Be not thou envious against evil men. See, we're not envious, right, against these evil men who rape, rob, and murder, man, and enslave God's chosen people, man. We don't give a damn about what y'all got going on. We don't give a damn about your traditions, man. Right? Hey, how you doing, brother? Hey, brother. Uh, 49 and a half. Hey, King. You believe in God, bro? Hey, look at this. Two seconds. See that? You need that mic, man. Hey, brother. Hey, brother. You see yourself on this side right here? We are here for our people, bro. The so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, man. And we got to separate from our enemies, man. Right. Too many of our people walking, holding hand in hand with the so-called white woman, man. That's right. It makes absolutely no sense, man. Right? You see that? How do you guys feel about slavery, man? How do you feel about slavery? About what, sir? About slavery. About the slavery that's happened to the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. How do you feel about it? Wrong, sir. Wrong, right? Yes, sir. Right. What was the main nation of people who funded the slave trade? They will be known as what today? Honest question. I don't know. They will, wouldn't it be the Caucasian race? Right? Who funded the slave trade? Right? So as something, you said that it's unfair, that it's not good. Should something happen to the Caucasian race for what they've done, right, to the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans? Has there been any type of punishment that's happened to them for what they've done? Or do they still benefit off slavery to this same day? What do you think? I don't think we can hold people for stuff from, from the past, man. I mean, now if it's happening today, you yeah. absolutely can. But. So let me ask you a personal question, right? Say you been, you got kids, you got a wife and kids. I got kids right here. Hold on, last question. Say that you and your wife and kids build up a house from the ground up, right? And you're, you got that house bought. And that house is going to be passed down to your generations. Right, and then me and my son, right, and my family, we come in, we break into your house, right, we take your wife, we sell her, we sell your children, and then we put you into slavery, and then all of a sudden, my children get to just reign in your house from generation after generation. If you knew that that was gonna happen, what would you do? See that? Don't wanna deal with it, man. You see that? Hey, where are the bold white people at, man? Right? Where are the bold white people like Clint Eastwood, man? Right? The so-called white man is scared nowadays. He can't answer a question. He don't want to deal with it, man. Right? This madness, man. Hey. Right? Bring that out again, King. Proverbs 24 and 1. This is the book of Proverbs, chapter 24, from the top. Bring it out. Be hey, not thou envious against evil men. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing, How you doing sister? Hey, real quick. Good, two seconds. Can you give me two seconds? I promise. All right, look. Check this out. Check this sign out right here, King. But brother, the most I didn't call you black. Then we called you an Israelite, God's chosen people from the tribe of Judah. See that? Our people don't care, man. They so caught up in the murk of this earth, man. Right? 
Matter of fact, give me Revelation, man. Chapter 18, man. Right, man. Matter of fact, Revelation chapter 17, starting verse 1. Right? Right? You give me Proverbs 3 and 31. Proverbs 3 and 31. Revelation chapter 17, verse 1. Proverbs 3 and 31. This, Let's deal with it, man. This is the book of Proverbs chapter 3, verse 31. Bring it out. Envy thou not the oppressor. We don't envy the East Indians. We don't envy the damn Islam. We don't envy the so-called white man. We damn sure don't envy the Chinese man, right? right? Because us Indian, these are our oppressors, man, is the reason why that we're still in this state right now. Go ahead and choose none of their way. And do what? And choose none, none of their way. way. So we don't choose the way of damn Christmas. We don't choose the way of Thanksgiving, man. We don't choose the way of not coming out and doing the work, you know what I'm saying? And waking up our people just to watch a football game, man. Right, right. Right? To support a team that fucking lost, man. Let's keep it 100, man. Right? No, the men of the Lord, man, we out where it's at, man. That's right. right. We outside the game, man. That's right. right? We out here in a, in a mist, man. Right? right? We out here in the trenches, man. Right to wake up our people, man. Right? Thus said the Lord, man. Read this out. This is what let's see. So T verse 1. We saw it. And there came one of the seven angels, uh -huh. which had the seven vibes. Right. And talked with me. Right. Saying unto me, uh -huh. come hither. I will show unto thee the judgment of the great whore. The Lord's got a judgment on America, right? That is a spiritual whore. Right. You have to understand that. Because there are people still benefiting on slavery, right? right? So-called white man and white woman and white child won't get the stolen ground, man. Right. The most high hates white people, man. That's hey. right. And y'all got to get ready to go into captivity and slavery, man. Hey. And blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans need to wake up and realize they're God's chosen people, man. That's right. And start keeping the law, statutes, and commandments, man. Thus said the Lord, man. Right? Keep reading. With whom the kings of the earth have committed fornication. Right. All these other kings of the earth have committed fornication, man. What the hell is a so-called Chinese man celebrating Thanksgiving for, man? Makes right. absolutely no sense, man. God bless you. We ask, we ask, we wait for you to go to sleep. That's right. The Lord don't love white people. That's he hates right. y'all, man. Right? Death to the so-called white man. That's right. Death to America, man. That's, That's right. right. Thus said the Lord. How you doing? What's your nationality, bro? On your father's side. Pacific Islander. Pacific Islander on your father's side? What about your mom? Black. She's black? All right, so you gotta let your mom know, right? Because it's through your father's seed, yeah. right? That so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans are God's chosen people as Israelites, the Bible speaks of. I heard it. Based on biblical facts, archaeology, and historical facts, brother. I heard it. You understand that? So make sure you show your mom that. All right, and tell her that she is a, she's a princess on earth, and that salvation is for her and her people, right? All right, man, you got any questions? All right, man. All praise on side. All praise on side, man. Right, continue to read on that. And the, and the inhabitants of the earth have been made drunk with the wine of her fornication. What has happened to all these nations? Have been what? Have been made drunk with the wine of her fornication. What's going on with our people who want to celebrate Thanksgiving? They're what? Have been made drunk with the wine of the fornication. All you nations are drunk with the wine of the fornication of America, man. That's right. Right? You're getting ready to go back home, right? Put that nasty plate in the microwave, right? Heat it up, right? Then you're gonna wake up tomorrow and eat it for breakfast, man, and go shop on Black Friday, right? right? With Black Friday, is celebrating our people being sold on slavery, man, right. right? Kids being stripped away from their families, man. Matter of fact, give me that, man. Give me Deuteronomy chapter 28, starting verse 32, man. Deuteronomy 28, 32. Uh, give me the book of, uh, you give me the book of uh, Zechariah, chapter 1, verse 15, right? The Most High is only here for the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. You are God's chosen people the Bible speaks of, man, right? And a so-called white man, white woman, and white child is the goddamn devil the Bible speaks of, That's man. Right. Thus said the Lord. How do y'all feel about that? See? How do you feel about that? That's what the white man does. He says something and runs off like a bitch. You see that? Right? Like a drunk bitch, man. Right? You see that? Wild man in nature, man. Right? Why do the heathen rage, man? Right? Read this out. Deuteronomy 28, 32. This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, verse 32. Bring it out. Thy sons and thy daughters 
shall be given unto another people. Right. The sons and the daughters, man, of the Native Americans was given to another people, man. Right? And who were they given to? The so-called white man. Right. The goddamn devil the Bible speaks That's right. Right. You see that? And y'all want to celebrate this wicked holiday, man. Right? All you see y'all fans celebrating Thanksgiving, I'm glad your team lost, man. Because the most high hates, right, Thanksgiving, man. The most high hates the so-called white man's holiday, man. Hey. How you doing, brother? Hey, brothers. See that? Right? I'm trying to fix, man. Right? Our people are too drunk with the wine and fornication of America, man. Right? Drunk off the so-called white man's beer, man. You see that? Why you got 49er fans? Because. Huh? You said what? Hey. See, the white man gets drunk and acts like a female. Hey. You see that? Hey. <laughs> Can't even fucking walk still, man. Right. Walk straight, man. Right. right? We win. We win. Right? Got his hand all out, man. Like a damn effeminate, man. Right. right. Read that one more time, man. This, this is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, verse 32. Read it out. Thy sons and thy daughters shall be given unto another people. Right. Go ahead. And thy, thy eyes shall long and oil with longing for them all the day long. Right. And our Native Americans have lost their children, man, to the so-called white people. Right. right. And they have not seen them, man. Right. Longing all day long. To the point that they died, man. Right, and the last time they saw their child, man, was at age two, age four, age six, age eight. This is why us as so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans should not be celebrating Thanksgiving, man. That's right. Right? The most I hate Thanksgiving, man. That's right. And the most I hate the so-called white man. That's right. The goddamn devil the Bible speaks That's about, right. Right? right? Bring this out. This is one verse 15. Go ahead. And I am very sore. Please. Right, the most high is very sore displeased. You got a lot of white people that like to come up to us, man, and say that, you know what I'm saying? Well, you're your own people, soldier. When we're not Hamites, man. Right? We understand that the Bible says that us as Israelites, that we did not obey the commandments. Right? right? And the punishments of that was us going into slavery by the hands of these wicked devils. Right. But what did the so-called white man do, man? Keep reading. With the heat How y'all brothers doing, man? Right, how you doing? Hey, y'all see yourself in the sign real quick? Hey, we're God's chosen people, bro. You're gonna wanna know who you are in these last days, man. Right? You see that? What's your nationality, man? Huh? What's your nationality? My On your father's side? Huh? On your father's side? Yeah. You believe in God? Yeah. You said what? You have to. That's right, you have to. You know God has a chosen people and you would be one of them? So the Most High God, brother, didn't call you Mexican. He called you an Israelite, brother, from the tribe of Jesucar. You That's see right. that? And your royalty out here, man. Right? Isn't this wasn't this land given to y'all first? And wasn't it stolen by your oppressors? Yeah. Who stole this land from y'all? Who would they be as today? You're looking at them. Oh, you. you gotta repent and keep the commandments and accept the fact that you have enemies. Except right. the fact that the Most High God loves you and you want it, man. Right, right, right. That's the problem, man, with our people. They got Stockholm Syndrome, man, right? They got PTSD, post-traumatic slavery disorder, man, right? You want to know what we doing up here? Right, see that put that hand, that, that, that wicked ass Baptist church hand up in the damn alleyway and walks off, right? right? Read that one more time, man. Zechariah 1 and 15. And I am very sore to please with the heat in there all at Eve. That's never gonna change. The Most High is sore displeased with you heathens, man, right? With you wicked nations who are not blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. Go ahead. For I was but a little displeased. For I was what? But a little, little displeased. displeased. See, the Lord was only a little displeased with the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. Just a little bit, man. Go ahead. And they help forward the affliction. What did these heathens do? And they help forward the affliction. What's the so-called white man doing? Rape, robbery, and murder? And they help forward the affliction. They help forward our affliction, man. So yeah, it was meant for us to go into their into their possession, man, for now right. listening to the commandments. Right. But the so-called white man, who's a goddamn devil, the Bible speaks of, man, right. took it to all-time heights, man. Right. That's why we shouldn't celebrate this wicked-ass day, man. That's said the Lord, man, right? You can drop that, man. Give me the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, start at verse 21. Read all the way to 22, man, right? This, this is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter Give me the book of Leviticus, chapter 11, verse 19. Yeah. 
the Lord shall make the pestilence cleave unto thee, unto he have consumed thee uh -huh. from off the land. Right, the so-called white man came over here, man, right, with his nasty ass blankets, man, right, brought these nasty diseases, man, wow. right? Like Trump said, China did it, right? Hey, the white man had that same damn, you know what I'm saying, spirit, man, right? right? And it put that on the so-called Native Americans, man. Right. Go ahead. Whether thou goest to possess it, the Lord shall smite thee with a consumption uh -huh. and with a fever. With the consumption and with the fever, man. Right? This is in the Bible. This is prophesied, man. That the so-called white man was going to come over here, man, right? And not only slaughter these Native Americans, man, but hit them with illnesses, man, Bye. and diseases, man. Right? right? That's why the so-called white man is a goddamn disease walking on earth, man. That's right. right? Go ahead. And the inflammation and with an extreme burning. And with what? And with an extreme burning. The so-called white man brought chlamydia, man. Right? The so-called white man brought AIDS, man. Right? The so-called white man brought all these sexually transmitted diseases, man. Right. right? Extreme burning, man. Go ahead. And with the sword, and with lasting, and with mildew. With what? With mildew. What does the so-called white man smell like? Mildew. Y'all yeah. smell like mildew, man. Thus said the Lord, man. Right? Not thus said Samurai. Right? Thus said the Lord, man. That's right. right? That mildew you see on that, they got mildew on their damn bathtubs, man. That's right. They got mildew on their damn roofs. That's man. right. Right? And y'all want to follow these wicked devils, man. That's right. Makes absolutely no sense, man. We got to wake up, repent, and follow the law that you commit. That's right. right. Thus said the Lord, man. Drop that, man. Right? Bring this out, man. This is Leviticus 11, verse 19. Bring it out. Bring it the story. The heron after her kind, uh -huh. and the lop wing. And the what? And the lop wing. And the what? And the lop wing. Go ahead. And the bat. Uh, Leviticus 11 and 19. Salaki. Salaki. Leviticus 11 and 19. Uh, Salaki. Uh, might be. Uh... They shall be even an abomination. Are you guys Native American? Where's oh, slavery? Where's slavery? Is your father's side? I don't know. Is your father Native, Native American? What you got going on? We're teaching the so called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans that they're God's chosen people. Right? Hey, brother. You Native American? You would be God's chosen people. You're an Israelite from the tribe of Gad. Right, he didn't call you Native American, right. right? This land was taken from y'all, right, from the so-called white man, right, who the Most High God hates, man. That's right. Right, the Bible is our history book, brother. That's right. right. We've been taught lies through Christianity, Catholicism, man. All these man-made religions, right? The Most High is only dealing with his chosen people and salvation for you. Man. That's right. So you got to repent and keep the commandments, hey, right? All praise hey. the Most High, man. Right? Hey, we're, hey, we're on the same team. That's right. And hey, don't celebrate Thanksgiving, man. I don't celebrate Thanksgiving. That's right. Hey, that's why I came to the game. Cause I don't celebrate Thanksgiving. That's right. 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 Oh, president, no sign, man. Right? Well, we need our people to stop coming to the game, man, start coming to these laws, statutes, and commandments. Right. Right. right? Hey, you Hispanic, bro? Yes, sir. Hispanic? A little bit. You believe in God? Yes, sir. Well, just, hey, look, man. Right? You already got fringes on, man. You see that? Right. The most high, the most high God calls the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans Israelites. God, the real gods of the earth, man. You understand that? And we gotta repent and keep the commandments, That's brother. Right? Right? Yes, sir. right? So you're God's chosen people. Right? Don't follow the ways of these heathens. Don't celebrate Thanksgiving, man. Oh. Right? That's the death and destruction of your people and the Native Americans, man. And they still walking on stolen ground right now, man. Right? That belongs to God's chosen people. So you're an Israelite from the tribe of Issachar. Right, you got a phone on you? Okay, that's fine, man. Right? Make sure you go look that up, man. So-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans are God's chosen people. That's right. The real Israelites the Bible speaks of, that's man. That's right. Right? And salvation is only for us. That's right. I'm going to prove that with one verse and I'm going to let you go, man. Give me the book of Matthew, chapter 1, verse 21, man. Right? Matthew, chapter 1, verse 21, man. Right? Give me the book of Romans, chapter 9, verse 13, man. Right? Thus said the Lord, man. Right? We're not out here, man, for these other nations. We only out here for our people, right. our true brothers, man, our true right. sisters, man, who's right. gone through oppression and slavery, man, right? right? And we curse this wicked ass day, man, right. right? Matthew chapter 1, verse 21. Right? right. Matthew chapter 1, verse 21. Right? Romans 13. 
and give me Romans 9 and 13. Real quick, two for the for before they can go. Okay, here's oh. right here. Hold on, we'll get this first. Matthew 1 and 21. This book of Matthew is the word verse 21. We about to read the words of Christ, who's a so-called black man, right? And an Israelite from the tribe of Judah, right? Not that nasty, stinking so-called white man, right? Who's a picture of Caesar Borgia. Read. And she shall bring forth the son. Right, Mary's gonna bring forth the son. Like right, it's prophesied. Go ahead. And then so call his name Yehoshua. No, Yo, what would she call him? Yehoshua. So his name is not Jesus. The letter J was the last letter that was created in the alphabet. That didn't even come out to the 15 and 1600s. Christ was living way before then. And our actual language, right, is Hebrew. Like the conquistadors came and put that Spanish language on you, right? Dealing with the Spaniards. Like that's why the Spaniards and the actual Mexicans are not the same. Right? Just right. said the Lord, man. Christopher Columbus, by the Spaniard, came and raped, robbed, and murdered our people, man. Right? right? So we shall call his name Yahweh Shai, which means he that he that delivers. Right? right. Yahweh Shai is a Hebrew word for what they will say Jesus, right? Go ahead. For he shall save his people. No, so he's gonna save all people. Save his, his people. people. His people. From, he, from their sin. Right, because we've sinned against the most high God, man. Right? Because we've gone through oppression and slavery, man. Right? To the point that now we start following the ways of our oppressors, thinking that that's the way to get success. Right? The kingdom of God is going to be here on earth. And America is prophesied to be destroyed. Because this place is known for the most bloodshed committed, man. Right? And when America is destroyed, the most high God is going to beam us up out of here, man. To what the white man calls UFOs when that's in the Bible. He's going to place us back in the land of Jerusalem where we belong. Right. And we're going to have servants, handmaids, slaves. Everything they've done to your people, they're going to be done to them double fold. That's right. Last one. Right. Romans 9 and 13. This is the book of Romans chapter 9, verse 13. Let's see how the most high God, Yahweh, man, feels about these Caucasian races, man. Read. As it is written. As it is written. In Malachi chapter 1, verses 3. Go ahead. Jacob have I loved. Jacob's name got changed to Israel. Right? So everybody goes back to a forefather. Right? Jacob, the Israel, is the forefather of the Israelites, the 12 tribes, who are scattered on all four corners of the earth because of oppression and slavery. Right. So the Most High said that the Israelites, you, has he loved, go ahead. But Esau, who's a white man? But Esau, who's a so-called Caucasian man? But Esau, Esau, how about what? Have I hated? See, the Lord hates, man. Right? Contrary to popular belief of Christianity, Catholicism, hey. who teaches that we should love everybody, that God loves everybody. No, the Most High God only loves us, man. Right. Why would the Most High God, right, set up a kingdom, right, for a race of people who had raped and robbed and killed and murdered a whole nother race of people? Right. That wouldn't be fair, man. You see what I'm saying? Right? Everything that happened to them, that happened to us, gotta happen to them. That's right. That's right. So we gotta repent and keep the law, statutes, and commandments. Because right. right. salvation is for y'all, for y'all own. That's right. And we love y'all, man. We truly love y'all. I just met y'all, but I, but I, I, I'll, I'll give my life for y'all, man. That's, That's right. right. Because I'm commanded to give my life for my brothers and my sisters. That's man. right. That's Just right. said the Lord, man. Right? What's your name, family? One. One. Nice to meet you. I'm Sam Ron. How you doing, sister? What's your name? Huh? Okay. Nice to meet you. What's your name, brother? Jesse, man. All praise and no silence. All praise and no silence, man. All right? Hey, we love y'all, man. Have a good night. Right? You guys are Israelites. The Bible speaks of. Don't forget that, all right? Cristo es negro, no blanco. That's right. That's what Cristo es negro, no blanco. Right? Understand that? Right? Escucha Pablo Lava la Biblia. You understand that? All praise. Right. Hey, these guys are from your swallow, man. Come your swallow. Come your swallow. Come your swallow. Come your swallow. All praise and no silence, man. Right? We out here to wake up the sheep, man. The lost sheep. Right? We're not out here, man, to celebrate amongst these other wicked heathens, man, this damn holiday. Oh, hey, hey, brother. Hey, brother and sister. Hey, y'all. Hey, brother. Hey, God loves our people and our people alone. You're an Israelite, like the Bible speaks of. Watch yourself, brother. We got See that, brother? Brother been drinking that gin and juice, man. Right? On that Snoop Dogg spirit, man. See that? Almost busted his toe and his knee at the same time. Right? Uh, hey, brother, you got to turn in one scripture, brother? They're gonna look for the men of the Lord in these last days, man, when all hell breaks loose. But we're not gonna be out here, man. That's right. Trouble, man. That's right. But look, he got time for Ray Mysterio. See that? It makes absolutely no sense, man. Like, give me the book of Habakkuk, man. Right? Chapter 2, verse 5 again. <laughs> so, like, this is the book of Habakkuk. Give chapter 10. Start at verse 28. <laughs> this is the book of Habakkuk. Ray Mysterio. That's my dad. Hey, I'm are, you, are you Hispanic? Simon. Simon. I don't care, Give us 49ers. Yeah, man. Get off. That's right. See that? That's I done right. seen it all. 
Samoans and Rey Mysterio masks, man. I done seen it all, man. You got the Samoan man wants to be the, the, the Israelite man. All these other nations want to be us, man. That's right. right. How can we not see that as our people, man? Right, bring this out. This is the book of Habakkuk, chapter 2, verse 5. You know, yeah. Yay! Also, because he transgresseth by wine, uh -huh. he is a proud man. He is a what? He, he is, is a, a proud, proud man. man. What is the so-called white man? He, he is, is a proud, proud man. man. Right, the so-called white folks is proud men. Right. Right, they proud to walk freely on stolen ground up and down the streets of Seattle, man. Right. When this place was named Duwamish, man, it's right before the so-called right, white man right, came right, over right, here and pillaged right. this place, Teach man, King. right, and booted our people up out of here, man, Teach put them in reservations, man, start acting like a, that's damn uh, reparations, right. talking about we're gonna build you some damn casinos, man, right, and y'all can y'all can benefit off that. You got a question? I wanna I wanna video you and post you, okay, on Facebook, if you're okay with that. Yeah, that's fine. What's your nationality? Me, I'm Mexican. Oh, crazy! The most high, your father Mexican? Uh, yep. See, that's just a you. What a white mom. Uh, with a way, it doesn't matter. Give me numbers one and eighteen. Right? It's not about a mixed race. Okay, okay, Most of okay. God has a chosen people. Right. You understand that? Now I'm gonna show you through the scriptures that I'm that I'm, I'm speaking the truth. Right? Are you down for me to videotape you? Huh? Are you down for me to videotape you? Yeah, no problem. Okay. We want you to videotape so you can remember this information. And then share it, right? That's share right. Share all okay. you want, man. Right? Because right? right? this is this the information for all of our people, man. As black, this man is a Native American, man. Right? You can go ahead and hit record, man. Right, give me the book of numbers chapter 1 and 18. Right, yeah. This sister just asked, hey, my father is Mexican, but my mom is white. Right? Right. Does that make me an Israelite? Let's find out. This is the book of Numbers chapter 1 and 18. Bring it out. And they assemble all the congregation together uh -huh. on the first day of the second month. So you have the Israelites that are assembling themselves together. Go ahead. And they declared their pedigrees. They declared their pedigree. A pedigree is your nationality, your heritage, your lineage. Go ahead. After their family, uh huh, by the house of their father. No, you all you are through your mother. By oh, the house, house of, of their, their father. So because your father is a so-called Mexican, right, who will be an Israelite sister from the tribe of Issachar. That's right. Because right. he didn't call you Mexican. That just means mixed, right? The Most High says that you are an Israelite from the tribe of Issachar because your father is an Israelite from the tribe of Issachar. That's right. That's right. Because the man is the one who makes, who determines the seed. He, he's the one that carries the seed and plants it in the womb of the woman. Right? If I go take an apple seed and plant it in Florida where it's known for building oranges, an apple tree is still going to come out. That's right. You see what I'm saying? And that's how you got to realize the Most High God is not dealing with a skin tone. He's dealing with a chosen bloodline. That's right. And because you have royal chosen bloodline, like we have to be, uh, behave our ways in a way so that we can get salvation because salvation is truly for us, man. Thus said the Lord. Give me the book of Deuteronomy chapter 28. Sorry, verse 50, 50. Bring it out! Y'all got an Instagram? Uh, yes, WFICL. It's okay. It's good. It's good. WFI. WFI. Space. Out. Yep, right there. Right, go ahead and follow. Right, and I'll hit you up on my personal thing. Right, we love you, sister. You initial like the Bible speaks of. All right. Oh, uh, you too, sister. Be safe. Right? Gonna tell you that. Okay, kind. All praise on all side, man. Right, you see that, man? Right. We're not giving out free hugs, man, for the nasty speaking white. That's right. Right. We're giving out free hugs to our people. Our people need hugs. Man. Our people are sitting there going through strife and tribulation, man. That's right. They going through downfalls, man. Right. right. From following these wicked ass nations, man. Right. right. Uh, where? And we got Cairo News out here, man. You see that? Hey, ladies. Look at it. 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 Look yeah. I'm half native, half Mexican. Yeah, okay. oh, wait, is your father Mexican or native? My father is native. You're an Israelite the Bible speaks of, God's chosen people. That's right. You're an Israelite from the tribe of Gad, man. Gotta repent and keep the commandments. That's How you doing, right. sister? Yeah, what? What's your nationality? Are you uh, Hispanic? What is God gonna do with it? What is God what? What is he gonna do with that? Okay. What's your nationality? That doesn't matter, does it? It does matter to the most high God. No, it doesn't. Are you sure about that? Yes. You read the Bible? Yes. You believe in God? Yes. Give me Deuteronomy 32 and 7. Yes. Bring it out! Give me Deuteronomy 
me 32. Sorry, boss. And give me Romans 1 16. All right, give me that. Romans 1 and 16. Well, let me see that. Let me see that. Hold on, give so, me uh, Deuteronomy 32 7. And you give me Romans 1 and 16. Yeah, it's under my shell of the gospel. All right, you know what the gospel is according to the Bible? Yes, I am. So, what it's is the preach? gospel? Preach, I'll be ashamed of it. Okay, let's see. All right, matter of fact, give me a list. Let's get her the gospel. Give me the book of Luke, chapter 4, verse 16. Oh. Let's see if God is for everybody. Right? Yes. Wait, wait, first of all, what is your denomination? My denomination? You don't have a denomination. The Bible's not a denominational book. So what are you to me? What, what am I to you? I'm your brother no, if you are no, a black, no. Hispanic, and Native American why woman. Why are you judging me? I'm not judging you. Okay, then. Have I judged you? You said it. I'm, what the Bible God do me? No, we did not judge you, sister. Yeah. Right? We just trying to have a dialogue right. to, uh, uh, to uh, teach uh, you who so. you truly are. Right? Yeah. Right. Give me the book of Deuteronomy 32. Man. Yeah. Right, dude. The book of Deuteronomy. Right. Let's do this. Uh -huh. Verse 6. No. Do ye thus require the Lord? I said Romans. One, We're going to get Romans. We're going to get it. Don't give us seven. I said 116. So I'm going to share the gospel. I'm not sharing the Remember the days of old. Consider the years of many generations. Ask thy father, and he will show thee thy elders, and they will tell thee. Listen to this, key point, verse 8. When the most high divided. When the most high what? When the most high divided. What did he divide? To the nations, uh -huh. their inheritance. So the most high divided the nations. Right? He's never been about all nations of people being together. Right? He has a chosen people, which would be the Israelites, the Bible speaks of, who are the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans of today. Well, it's not literally that. How about that? What is your nationality? It doesn't matter. Why doesn't it matter? We're Gentiles. Who are, there's two different types of Gentiles. No, we're all Gentiles. If we're not Jewish, we are Gentiles. Have you been drinking? No. So if we are not Jewish, we are Gentile. What is the term Jewish mean? I am Gentile. What is the term and Jewish? I am grace, saved by him. Saved by him? So you feel like you're saved? I am. Give me Matthew chapter 24, it's out of verse 13. Let's I find out. Still, and you still didn't call my verse. Give me Romans 1 and 16. Let's get that first. Romans this is the book of uh, Romans chapter 1, verse 16. Read it out. For I am not ashamed of the gospel uh -huh. of Christ. For it is the power of God unto salvation uh -huh. to everyone that believeth, to the Jews first. To the what? To, to the, the Jews, Jews first. first. Uh -huh. And also to the Greeks. And also to the what? And also, also to, to the, the Greeks. Greeks. So when it says and also are to you the Jews and Greeks, we're the real Jews no, of no, Bible no, no. speaks. Are you all Jews and are Greeks? You, are you a Greek? No, I'm a Gentile. You're a Gentile. Yes. What you are, are you talking about when it's saying Greek? Uh, are you a Gentile or Greek or not? We, we were once called Gentiles, yes. Uh, as Already Israelites, the Bible speaks of. Because we've been sold by actual Gentiles no, in slavery and was actually it. forced. Go ahead, quote it. Let's quote it. Let's get it for it. Give me the book. Give me the book. Let's quote it for it. Give me the book of 1 Corinthians okay. chapter 12, man. Read Sorry, it verse out. Right? We're not unlearned men. No, 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 no. Right? We're not going to come out here read the Bible and not know what we're talking about. Right? Exactly. Let's find out, right, if the Israelites were called Gentiles. 1 Corinthians chapter 12, Sorry, verse 1. Right? The Jews are the real people. And let's find out what the gospel means, man. Right? Exactly. Right? Go ahead, Give me the book of hey, Luke. Give me the right. book of Luke. Give me the book of Luke, chapter one. You don't even have your Bible out here. I know, I know it. I know it. You know it. I know it. No, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Luke chapter one. In the jungle, what? Luke chapter one. Sorry, He's just talking over exactly. the Bible. Luke chapter one, verse sixty-eight. This is the book of Luke, chapter one, verse sixty-eight. Bring it out. Yeah. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel. No, of all nations. Of Israel. Of, Israel. of all nations. Of Israel. Of Israel. Go ahead. For He have visited and redeemed His people. This is Christ speaking. Go ahead. And have raised up a horn of salvation. And raised up a horn of salvation. Go ahead. For us. For the, us. The for the house of, of the house of David. Of the house of what? The house the of David. David. Gentiles don't come from the house, the house of David. David. That is read. Gentiles. Read. And has spake by the mouth of his holy prophets. The prophets are Israelites, not Gentiles. Go ahead. Which have been since the world began. That the world was made for the sake of the Israelites from the beginning. Go ahead. That we should be saved. From our enemy. From our what? From, From our, our enemy. enemy. So there's a group of, listen, listen. There is a, there's a group Who's of people. Who's the enemy? First Who? of all. No, 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 no. 
Women are to be stuck. Give me for give me no. give me second no, 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 Timothy, no, no, no. man. Give me first Timothy chapter two verse twelve. Right? We're not about to let a woman right take the million over a man. She's out of order, man. Right? That's it, the Lord. She came up here to learn, but don't even want to talk during the Bible when the Bible's coming out, man. Right? You don't know the Bible at all, man. Give me first Timothy chapter two verse twelve, man. That's why I'm not dealing with that, man. Exactly. It's a recording, and you do not know the Bible because this your woman. We're Gentiles. Right? You, should, you should get her in order. No. I wouldn't allow my woman to come no, no, no. up to random men. Like, oh. I, I was actually off. No, no, no. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Look, she just so, told the man to go away. <laughs> see how backwards America is, man? Yeah. You see that? Well, see who married, right? Who I'm not your man. Don't be in my face, please. I got a wife. Who was? No, no, no. You should back up. You should marry. You should back up. Who was married? Oh, stop. Bring this no. out. Who was this is the book of Second Timothy. This is the book of First Timothy. Mary Madeline? It might be Second Timothy. No. No, ain't nothing about that. No, right there. That's what I want. But I saw her woman. Not... Verse twelve. Yeah, she's drunk. <laughs> you see that? Look at that, man. Right? And she's probably not an Israelite, man. You see that? Drunk off the wine of the fornication, That's man. Right. 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 How you right. doing, brother? How you doing, Katie? What's the name, brother? Man, I seen you before, bro. Uh, the Dollar Store. Oh, that's man. right, that's yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, see, yeah. man. Right? You, too, man. you know you in this life, then, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hell yeah, man. I man. Right, What you doing about it now, though? Man. Now that you've learned that you're in this life, you're talking about what? I've been woke, though, brother. I've been woke. Man. Okay. What tribe you from, though? What is the most high thing? This is like from tribe of what? Ain't from my tribe. Right. Well, you gotta be from somewhere, brother. Right? You gotta be, you gotta be. All nations of people have to be from somewhere. That's right. Right? So would you be, be honest with you, brother, if you recognize yourself as a black man, you would be an Israelite from the tribe of Judah. That's right. That's your real heritage and nationality. Right? Do you know who else is from Judah? Me! You know who else is from Judah? Like Give me that book of Hebrews 7 and 14. Hebrews 7 and 14. Bring, bring this out real quick. Second Timothy. Oh, first Timothy 10 as well. This is the book of 1 Timothy chapter 2 verse 12. Bring it out. But I suffer not a woman to teach. To what? To teach. Go ahead. Or to uh, observe authority over the man. All right. She came up here, man, trying to absorb authority over us men. Right. She even absorbed authority over her own man. Right. right? Sit there and grabbed him. Like, you saw how weak the white man was. He couldn't even move her out the way. Right. You see that? Most times not dealing with women, you know what I'm saying, teaching the Bible, man. That's right. Right, because right? they don't understand what's going on. They gotta be taught by their husband, man. That's right. Right? And if you don't have a husband, you need to be you need to get in this Bible and be taught by the most high God. Now let's get this for the brother, man. Hebrews 7 and 14. This, let's find out who's from Judah. This is the book of Hebrews chapter 7, verse 14. Yeah. Right for it is evident. For it is evident. There's factual evidence. Go ahead. That our Lord, that Christ, go ahead. Spring out of Judah. Spring out of what? Spring out of yeah. Judah. Judah. So guess what, bro? You got Christ's blood sure. in your system, family. Yeah. Right? Sure. Christ is a so-called black man who looks just like us, man. Yeah. Right? And this is like from the tribe of yeah. Judah. He's not that so nasty stinking so-called white man. Like that image that's been put on all of our people, man. Right? So knowing that we have a savior that looks like us, bro. It's for y'all too, man. Two seconds, man. All on outside. All on outside. Let's continue to keep bringing it up. Let's continue to keep bringing it out, right? Give me the book, uh, go back to 1 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 28. I don't know if we brought that out yet. No, you good, King. You good, King. All praise the most high, man. All praise. That's what's up, that's what's up, man. All praise, man. Right? No, that's fine, King. That's fine, I just want you to know that you're an Israelite. You gave me one scripture, one scripture to leave you here. One scripture. Hold that, give me the book of, uh, give me the book of Deuteronomy. Chapter 10, starting verse 12. Last scripture, I'm gonna let you go. Yeah. Right? Because yeah, now you know you're an Israelite, this is what the most high wants you to do. All right, 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 right. right? right. You know, praising the most high, man. Right. right? In the midst of all these wicked devils, man, the most high send it up sheep, man. Right. right? Who wanna learn who they are, man? Right. right? Who wanna return to their heritage and their nationality? Right? Because salvation is truly for us, man. Right. Deuteronomy chapter 10, starting verse 12, read through 13. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 10, verse 12. Bring it out. Now, now, Israel, what is this, brother? And now, Israel, Israel, what? What do the Lord thy God require of thee? See, now you know you're an Israelite from the tribe of Judah, right? Yeah. It's one thing to just know that, but you're required of doing something. Like, this is my yeah. son, right? The most high blessed me with kids, 
But once yeah, he lets me yeah, with kids, yeah. I'm required, right, to make sure I take care of them, right? Because if I don't do the things that are required, right, then what's the point of me having children, right? Go ahead. But you, but, but you, no, but yeah. you fear God. But to do what? But, but you, you fear God. God. You gotta fear God, King. Go ahead. But you walk in His ways. To all walk his ways. in all His ways, bro. Not in the ways of our oppressors. Who want us to celebrate Thanksgiving and Christmas and all these wicked ass holidays? Go ahead. And that you love Him. Uh -huh. And to serve the Lord thy God right. with all thy heart and with all thy soul right. to keep the commandments. What's the key part? To, to keep, keep the commandments. commandments. Uh -huh. That the Lord right. to his statutes which I commanded thee this day for thy good. So we got to start keeping the commandments that were only given to us because it's for the good of our people. That's right. yeah. this, our, the reason why our people gone into slavery and oppression, brother, because we didn't keep the commandments. Right. So bad happened to us, brother. Right? And what's going to be good is us getting the kingdom, man. Right? Salvation coming for us, man. Us being rulers, man. Us having slaves and servants under us, man. But in order for that to happen, brother, we got to repent and keep the commandments of the That's Lord right. as an Israelite the Bible speaks of, family. All right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We love you, brother. Right? We love you, Hey, I'll let y'all, man. Call praise the most high, man. Hug your swallow. Hug your swallow. Hug your swallow. Hug your swallow. Come on. Give me the book of 1 Corinthians. We'll get a few more. Give me the book of 1 Corinthians, man. Right? Chapter 10, start at verse 28. Give me the book of Exodus, chapter 23, start at verse 2. Mighty teaching, King. Right? Bring it out. This is the Corinthians chapter 10, verse 28. Bring it out. But if any man say unto you, uh -huh. this is offered and sacrificed to the idols. Right. Oh, you got a lot of our people that want to eat food, right? That have offered the sacrifices of idols, man. Right? When y'all sitting there eating that damn nasty turkey, man, on damn Thanksgiving, man. Right? When you know Thanksgiving is actually celebrating the death and destruction of our people, man. Right? right? That is food sacrificed into idols, man. Right. Even though it's clean, according to the scriptures, man. Right? These are things we got to realize, man. Right? Go ahead. Eat not for a sake that sold you. Eat what? Eat not for a sake that sold you. Uh huh. You see that? So don't partake in that wicked ass traditions, man, of men. The Most High is not dealing with wicked traditions of men. The Most High has his own days, man, right? The holy days of the Lord, man. That's right. right. We got Feast of Dedication, man. Feast of Tabernacles, man. Right. right? Passover, man. Right. right. Pyram, man. Right. right. Destruction of Nicanor, man. Right. 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 We got feast days that celebrate the death and destruction of oh, our enemies, man. That's right. That's right. So why are we going to partake in a damn wicked holiday, man, Name. that celebrates the death and destruction of my people? Man? Right. It makes absolutely no sense, man. Right. right? Thus said the Lord, man. Bring us out, man. This is the book, Exodus chapter 23, verse 10. Give me first Maccabees. Uh, uh, never mind. Give me uh, Psalms 55 and 21. Bring it up. In the six years, thou shalt... No, Exodus 23 and 2. This is the book of Exodus, This is the book of Exodus chapter 23, verse 2. Bring it out. Thou shalt not follow a multitude to do evil. The Lord said that we're not going to follow a multitude to do evil. That's right. See, these evil, these evil people of the multitude of people, man. Right? We're looking at it right now. Right? Dancing in the middle of the street, man. Right, like damn, you don't say drunkards. See that? Light up people walking around and feeding the street right. with light up balloons, man. Right. right, most of us not dealing with that. Right. Grown ass men walking around here with light up balloons. Makes absolutely no sense, man. Right? That damn I am Sam spirit, man. Right? right. right? People sitting there thinking that I'm just coming to watch the damn game. Right? With all the games that are played today, we're representing Thanksgiving. Right. Representing the death and destruction of the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. Man. Right. Right? There's nothing to be thankful about that, man. Right. Right? And we hate Thanksgiving, man. That's right. Right? right. And we hate the so-called white man. He's the goddamn devil the Bible says. That's right. That said the Lord, man. So we're not gonna follow a multitude to do evil. Go ahead. Neither shall thou speak in a cause to decline after many to press your judgment. Right, we're not gonna sit here and sing they wicked ass songs, man. Right? We're not gonna walk around here with pilgrim hats on, man. Right? right? And nasty witch boots with big ass buckles on the side, man. Talking about I'm a pilgrim, man. Right? I'm not dealing with my kids not coming home, man. Right? With paper turkey hats, man. Right. Right? Made out of their goddamn hand. Right. Talking about look what we did in school today, mommy. Look what we did in school today, daddy. Both sides not dealing with that, man. If I see one of my kids walk in that house, man, with one of them hats, man, I'm gonna take that goddamn hat right. and I'm gonna tear it in pieces, That's man. Right. That's right. Right, bring this out, man. This, uh, Give me first, Maccabees uh, chapter two, starting at verse 10. Five, verse one. Bring it out. The words of his mouth were smoother than butter. The words of the so-called white man's mouth is smoother than butter, man. That's right. Right? He speaks smooth things, man. Right? You see it through his commercials, man. Right? Especially during these damn wicked-ass holidays, man. 
right? And they use Jake's and Eve's, man, like to be the focal forefront for their damn com uh, commercials, man, because they want to keep our people in wickedness, man. Right, right, come smoother than butter, man. Go ahead. But war was in his heart. But what? But war was in his heart. So the so-called white man came over here to America, man, right? Ask the Native Americans, man, how do you grow these crops? How do you make the land so beautiful, man? Probably ask them how to brush their damn teeth, man, right? right? We know they damn heathens and dogs the Bible speaks of. Right. right? Have no etiquette about themselves, man. Right? Then once our people sit there and held hand in hand with them, man, when the Bible says in Proverbs, give me uh uh in a, nah, hold that. Uh hold that, give me Proverbs 11 and 21. Got it. Right? Why well, our people want to hold hand in hand with the enemy? You guys Hispanic? You guys Hispanic? You guys are God's social people if you are, man. You gotta repent and keep the commandments, man. Right? Proverbs 11 and 21 real quick. And then we'll jump back to uh, verse 9. Okay, right here. Channel 2 verse 9. This is the Proverbs chapter 11 verse 21. Bring it out. Though his hand joint in hand, right? the wicked shall not be unpunished. So you Native Americans and Hispanics got to know, right? Yes, your ancestors, our ancestors, man, decided to join hands, man, with the so-called white man. Right. Right? In the land of America, man. Right? But understand that they are still the wicked the Bible speaks of. That's right. And they're not going to be unpunished, man. Right? So we gotta realize that, man, and come out of the ways of Babylon the Great. Come out of the ways of this wicked damn earth, man. Right. Come out of the ways of this great whore, man. Right? Read that again. The words was about, we're smoother than butter. Well, what? We're smoother than, than butter. butter. Uh huh. But war was in his heart. Right? How do you feel about Thanksgiving, man? Huh? All right. Let's see if he's a man of his word. Right? You know how I'm feeling today, man? I want to see one of these goddamn heathens bow down to these Israelites, man. That's good. Right, that's the mood I'm in today, man. Thus said the Lord, man. Right? The words of his mouth were smoother than butter. Right? He came back. Right? Hold on, real quick. What's your name? Christian. Christian? It's Christ like. He said, huh? I do him. He said, Christian? It's Christ like. It's Christ like. Okay, what's your nationality? Caucasian. Caucasian, right? Now, how do you feel about slavery that's happened to the so called blacks right here, Hispanics and Native Americans? from the hands of the Caucasian race. How do you feel about that? How do I feel about it? Yeah. It's terrible. It's terrible, right? Yeah. Right? Has something, has there been a punishment that's happened to the Caucasian race, right, for what they've done to the Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans? Or are they, or are they still walking around here? How much, how much history are you talking about? Because you're going back 200, 400 years. You go back 400, 800 years. Thousand years, your own people were enslaving your own self. Let's deal well. with that. Give me Exodus. Right. Chapter, give me Exodus chapter one. All right. That's what we hear from the Caucasian race no, all the time. No, 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 that our own people enslaved each other, but we're not Africans. I'm gonna show you that through the Bible. All right. right. I'm gonna show you that. Not my own understanding. So right. Give me Exodus chapter one, starting verse eight, read all the way to ten. Right. We're the real Hebrews. The Bible speaks of the right. Israelites. No, the Bible not, speaks of. I'm not of. complaining about what you know. Because facts are facts. Facts are facts. I agree. And there's nothing wrong with facts. Right, nothing well, wrong you're not going to run me back a thousand years and, so, make, and make me feel bad for something I didn't have nothing to do. So our people, can you not like that? My son's right. Appreciate it. You guys have a good day. Right. Thank you. But black people still getting hung to this damn day. Right. right. Make it make sense, man. Have a good day. You see that? We'll have a good day when you go into slavery, man. That's right. That's right. right. No, we're not going. No, we're not. Because you come over here. Fuck you too, bitch. How about, how about that? Fuck you. Fuck you too, bitch. You go to slavery. Right? And the so-called black woman needs to separate from the wicked devils, man. Right. You got right. blood in her hair because she want to be like the white woman. Right. Makes absolutely no sense. And the most eyes, and they are damn bitches, man. That's if you got a problem with that, I don't give a damn, man. Most eyes not dealing with you scared Israelites these days, man. That's right. Right? Gonna walk up and, and ask one of our men to come here, come here. Like we, like we, like we belong to them. Right? No, we waking up in our captivity, man. That's right. Just said the Lord, man. Right? The words of his mouth are smoother than butter, man. You can drop that. Give me the book of 1 Maccabees, chapter 2, starting verse 10. Right? The book of Maccabees, chapter 2, Give me verse Psalms 10. 58, verse 3. What nation have not had a part in her kingdom? Right. What nation have not had a part, right, in selling the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, man? Right. Right? Why does nasty, stinking, so-called white man want to say that we got sold by our own people? No, we got sold by the Hamites, man. That's right. The Lord said, in what nation, man? Go. Go ahead. And gotten of her spoils. And gotten of her spoils, man. Right? These are the things we got to realize, man. They still benefiting on stolen ground, man. Right? right? 
They took all of our manufacturers, man, right? We just got missing books in the Bible, man, that, that we're missing right now, right. right? Because they've been burnt up, man, right? right. Filling in 70 AD, man. Right. These are things we gotta realize, man. Right. He was to talk about that nasty single white man don't talk about, oh, we, why are we talking about history? Right, from hundreds and hundreds and thousands of years ago. Right. Man, it's still present day. We still right, getting raped, right, robbed, and murdered, right. man. Right. It's present day, man. We still in slavery, man. Most I said, these right. we're going to be on our people forever, man. That's right. Just right. the Lord, man. Right? Psalm 58 and 3. Psalm 58, verse 3. Bring it out. The wicked are estranged from the womb. Right? The most I said, the so called white man was wicked the moment that he got placed right into his father's nutsack, man. Right? The moment that he got placed into his mother's womb. Right? The moment that that, sh that, that that semen shot out, man, right? And they racing, right? They were racing wickedly, man. Right? right? Go ahead. They go straight as soon as they be born. Uh huh. Speaking lies. Right, speaking lies, man. As soon as that so called Caucasian race come out that damn womb, right? And automatically start speaking lies, man. Right? Uh -huh. The moment that doctor hits that Caucasian baby on that ass, right? And then a the baby starts crying and screaming like they being oppressed. They already speaking lies, man. That's right. Right? They already speaking lies, man. Right. The hell you crying for, man? Right? You were put here, you know what I'm saying? This is your heaven, man. Right? We had our babies, right? Of Native Americans, man. Right? Seminole Indians, right? Hispanics, right? And blacks, man. You know what I'm saying? As soon as that baby came out the womb, they were taken away and sold to another people. Right. Let's make it make sense, man. Right? So yeah, the most high hates you so-called white people, man. That's right. right. Thus said the Lord, man. Right? Bring this out. This is the book of First Maccabees, chapter 2, verse 16. Bring it out. Oh, and when many of Israel came unto them, uh-huh. Matha, 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 Matthias also and his sons came together. Right, go ahead. Verse 17. Then answered the king's officers. They what? And answered the king's officers. Go ahead. And said to Matthias, uh -huh. on this wise. Thou art a ruler uh -huh. and an honorable and great man. You got a lot of these wicked heathens, man, like that try to hit us with flattery, man. Right. right? Try to hit us with flattery and words. Right. You got your own family members that hit you with flattery and words. Right. Oh, just come over, man. You know what I'm saying? And, and join in, right? The Thanksgiving festivities, man. Right. Right? You got that damn, you know what I'm saying? The most I'm not dealing with a so-called white man, man. Keep up the goddamn block. Man. That's right. right. Right? We can't wait for y'all to go to slavery, man. That's, That's right. right. Yeah, we said what we said, right. and we stand on what we said, That's man. Right. So keep it up the block, man. Right? Most of us not dealing with that Eli man in spirit, man. Big nose, big ears, big mouth spirit, man. Right? Read that one more time, verse 16. Verse 16. And when many of Israel came unto them, uh -huh. Matthias also and his sons came together. Right? Then answered the king's officers and said to Matthias, What did they say? On this wise, thou art a ruler and an honorable and great man. Right, you're going to have your grandma to go inside and sit there and tempt you and be like, I know that you believe in the truth, right? I know that you believe that we're the Israelites the Bible speaks of. I know that you don't celebrate these wicked ass holidays, man. But guess what? Grandma Betty just came into town. She ain't seen you in years, man. Right. Why don't you just stop by the house and say hello? Right. You wouldn't even got to grab a plate, man. Right? Matter of fact, I'll make you a to-go plate, right? You can eat it the next day, man. Right? You got a lot of our people that are going to be fooled by these flattering words, man. Right. right? You got ESPN, man. Right? You got all these sports sports channels, man, talking about Thanksgiving football games, man. This is the time to get together with your friends. The time to get together with your family members, man. Right? right? We were all blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, man, to partake in this, man. Right? Then it puts a spirit on brothers, man. They don't want to do the damn work, man. Right, right. Because they rather partake in watching a football game, man. Right. Right? right. Because they entice with flattering words, man. Bring it out. Right? We gotta stop being enticed by the so-called white man. That's stop right. being enticed by the damn devil the Bible speaks That's of. Right. right? And be enticed by these law, statutes, and commandments, That's man. That's right. And realize we got our own feast days. We got our own holy days, That's man. Right. To keep. Go ahead. That's right. Verse 17. Uh-huh. And strengthen my sons and brethren. Uh-huh. Now, therefore, come thou first and fulfill the king's commandment. Right. So you're going to have a lot of these nations, man. We're seeing it already, man. They want us to fulfill their commandments. They set out righteous decree, uh, unrighteous decrees, man. 
right? They want you to celebrate Thanksgiving. Right. They want you to celebrate Christmas, man. They want you to turn around and celebrate New Year's, man. Which goes into the celebration of Janice, man, right? That wicked ass devil, man. Go ahead. Like as all the heathen. That's all the what? All, all the, the heathen, heathen Go ahead. have done ye, I mean done yea, and the men of Judah also. And all the men of what? That's fine. You're good. You're good. Move her? Yeah. Read that one more time. This is the book of First Maccabees, chapter 2 and verse 18. Yeah. Now, therefore, come now first. And fulfill the king's commandment, right? Like as all the heathen have done, right? Yea, and the men of Judah also, and such a man at Jerusalem, right? So all these heathens, man, right? Love following the heathen ways. This is why heathens mingle with each other, man. Right? The most I'm not dealing with us mingling amongst these heathens, man. Right? Don't follow a multitude to do evil, man. Right? And they trying to tempt Mattathias, man, to follow the ways of these heathens. Let's see what Mattathias and his sons did. He read. So shall thou and thy house be in the number of the king's friends. Right. And thou and thy children shall be honored with silver and gold. With and what? With silver and gold. Right. right. They want to sit there and have you partake in this wicked ass holiday Thanksgiving. So that you can be honored amongst their friends. Right. Who want to celebrate these wicked ass holidays. Uh. Huh? Right. You got people, man, that's sitting there, you know what I'm saying, uh, going to their parties at their damn jobs, man. Right, celebrating these wicked ass holidays, right. man. Because they're afraid about what their coworkers are gonna say the next day. Or such and such wasn't there, man. Or they're gonna come and ask you, why wasn't you there, man? Right? You got a lot of our people that are fearful of that, man. Right? No, you gotta stand boldly for the name of Yahweh. But still, must y'all come like Yahweh's side. That's right. Right? And many God. rewards. Uh huh. Then Mattathias answered and spake. With a loud voice. With a what? With a loud voice. But with a quiet voice. With a loud voice. We're going to come out and speak with a loud voice, man. That's right. Just said the Lord, man. That's right. So that wisdom cries throughout the streets, man. Go ahead. That all the nations. That all the what? That all the nations. Go ahead. That are under the king's dominion. Uh-huh. Obey him. Right. And fall away everyone from the religion of their fathers. Right. And gave consent. Right. They don't want us to keep our heritage, man. They don't want us to keep these law statutes That's commandments, right. man. Right. They want right. us to be niggas, man. They want us to be spicks, man. Right. right. They want us to partake in Thanksgiving. They want us to partake in Christmas, man. They want us to partake in all these wicked white man holidays, man. Go ahead. And give consent to his commandments. Right. Go ahead. Yet will I and my son. Yet will I and my brothers, man. Yet, well, I am my people, man. Right. Yet, well, I am Yahweh. But some of us y'all coming like Yahweh. Some of us y'all coming like Yahweh. And my brethren walk in the covenant of our father. What are we going to do? Walk in the covenant of our father. What are we going to do? Walk in the covenant of our father. What are we going to do? Walk in the covenant of our father. We're going to walk in the covenant of our father, man. But some of y'all coming like Yahweh. But some of y'all coming like Yahweh. Go ahead. God forbid that we should forsake. The law and the ordinance. God forbid. We're never gonna forsake the law and the That's ordinance. That's right. Just said the Lord, man. And if you got a problem with that, guess what, man? Right? Look at the dust that I beat, man. Right? right. See the dust, oh daughter of Babylon. Right. Because right. the most high is building up the blacks. It's That's right. Let me get a couple of calls and precepts, man. Right? Let me get the book of Isaiah, man. Right? Chapter 42, man. Sorry, verse 32. Right? Let me get the book of Revelation, chapter 18, man. Starting verse 4, man. Listen, matter of fact, verse 18, verse 21. Let's deal with it, man. Right? Most High hates Thanksgiving, and the Most High hates so called white men. That's right. The goddamn devil the Bible speaks of, man. Right? And we say that boldly, man. Thus said the Lord, man. Right? Get that one last. Bring this up. This, because that, 42, verse 13. Bring it out. The Lord shall go forth as a mighty man. The Lord what? The Lord, shall go forth forth as a mighty man. man. The Lord is gonna go forth as a mighty man. That's right. Like not a woman, right? He's gonna come forth as a mighty man. He's not a weakling, man. Right? He's not a nice guy, man. 
right? He don't love everybody. Go ahead. Right. He shall stir up jealousy. He shall what? He, he shall stir up jealousy. And you've seen jealousy, man. You've seen examples of it today, man. Out here with my brothers in Cedar Israel, man. These other nations are jealous, man, that we wake up to who we are, man. These other nations are jealous, man, that we got the boldness to come out here, man, right in the front of the Seahawks Stadium, right in front of the damn wicked ass, you know what I'm saying, Seattle Mariners Stadium, man, right, and proclaim thus said the Lord right. and wish death, man, to Babylon, man. Right. Go ahead. Like a man of war. Like a man of what? Like, like a, a man, man of war. war. It's a man of war, according he, to Exodus 15 and 3. Go ahead. He shall cry. He shall what? He, he shall cry. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah Right, and we tell our people been crying for so long, man. Our people been crying lamentations up to the most high for so long. Right. And now it's getting to that time we ready to war on these wicked ass devils, man. Yeah. Go ahead. He shall prevail against his enemies. He shall what? He, he shall, shall prevail against his enemies. What is the gospel? He, he shall, shall prevail against his enemies. Go ahead. I have long time holding my peace. And we long time holding our peace. Man. That's right. right. Hey. How long are we going to continue to hold our peace? Right, and follow the ways of these wicked devils. Right. How long are we gonna hold our peace, man? Right, and celebrate these wicked ass holidays. Right. Man, right. Hey. Talking about it's just family time. It's just time with my friends, man. Right. right? No, we're not holding our peace, man. Yeah. Right, go ahead. Hey, I do still and refrain myself. Uh-huh. Now will I cry like a travailing woman. woman. And we can't wait for the day where the so-called white woman, white man, and white child gonna be travailing like a damn travailing woman. Right. Right? Gonna be crying, man, like they're getting ready to give birth, man. At the sight of these missiles, man. At the sight of martial law, man. At the sight of World War III and death and destruction, man. Go ahead. I will destroy. And I will what? I will, I will destroy. destroy. What's the Lord gonna do? I, I will destroy. destroy. Go ahead. And, and devour at once. At once. At once, man. And we can't wait for Babylon the Great to be devoured at once, man. Right? Revelation 18 21. We're gonna end it with this. This is the book of Revelation, chapter 18, verse 21. Bring it out. And a mighty angel, angel took, took up a Stone, took like, up a what? Took, took up, up a stone. stone. Hey, the Most High is sending these angels, man, right, to gather these stones together, man. Like the 12 stones, man. The 12 tribes of Israel, man, that the Bible speaks of. Go ahead. That's right. Like a great millstone. Like a what? Like, like a, a great millstone. Right, go ahead. And, and cast, cast it into, into the sea. sea. And did what? And, and cast, cast it into the sea. sea. That's why the Most High, man, is casting the servants of the Lord, man, into the sea. The sea is going into these nations, man, right, on all four corners of the earth. Everywhere you go, you're going to get this judgment. Everywhere you go, you're going to get this word, man. Everywhere you go, so-called black, Hispanic, Native American, man, woman, and child, you're going to be told to repent, man, and come back to these law, heritage, and nationality. Go ahead. Say it. That's with violence. That's with what? That's with violence. That's with us. That's with violence. That's with Seahawks game. That's with violence. That's with damn clear balloons. That's with violence. That's with being a drunkard. That's with violence. Shout out. That great city, Babylon, be thrown down and shall be... No more, more at all. And this place gonna be found no more at all. Last one, Psalms 118, verse 17. Bring it out. 118, verse 17. Bring it out. Oh, I shall not die. die. What the Lord say? I shall not die. die. What the Lord say? I shall not die. die. But live. But what? But live. But what? But live. But what? But live. But what? But live. And declare the worst. Of and we're going to declare the worst of Yahweh. Bless him and let Yahweh come on the Yahweh's child, man. And with that, I'm going to leave this for you. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go.